Hello guys, this is Viteri, Usman and Sam, and welcome to a little Skyrim um, tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to join the um, Dark Brotherhood in Skyrim, the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Um, this can be done on any platform from Skyrim, from console to PC. And uh, yeah, so let's jump in. So, so, bleh, let's jump into this tutorial's video. Oh. I don't know, I haven't done stuff like this before, so give me a chance. Okay, so first thing you need to do when you're going to um, join the Dark Brotherhood, you need to go over to... where is it now? You need to go over to Windhelm, if you haven't explored this place, um, it's just right next to uh, um, this place. It's, it's right next to the um, um, White Run, but just go across, keep on going across into the snowy area, then you'll find Windhelm. Um, okay, so you know what you need to do is a fast travel, and as soon as you're there, you need to. She looks so creepy. Okay, so as soon as you're in Windhelm, all you need to do is turn right over here to these stairs, and then just go um, straight ahead. Um, you don't want to go down there, or you're going to be in hell. But just go straight, and then just go here, and you'll find like this little um, little bridge, and there's this little kid and this woman. I don't know what's kind of going on there, but you want to go in this door here, don't be confused, but you want to go in this one. This is a novice lock, this does not count as any um, bundle or bounty, whatever you call it, um, against Windhelms, don't worry, you're not going to get told off by the guards. So yeah, it's novice, so it's going to be pretty easy for you if you're like me and if you're not that good at pick locking. But yeah, as soon as you're in the room, uh, there's this boy on the floor. I'm not injured, but he's kind of just like kind of just like playing with stuff. So yeah, um, as soon as you're in there, just keep on um, going around there, and then you'll find this kid on the floor. Talk to him. Say, are you all right? He's a bit, um, a bit. He's a bit of a crack house, so do um, excuse a bit of the. Um, and then he starts going on about the Dark Brotherhood. So what you want to do, I said, I'm sorry, boy, but I'm uh, not who I you think I am. Okay, so click that one. Of course you are. I prayed, and you came, and now you'll accept my contract. Then click contract. My mother, she, she died. He tells you a bit about his mother and that she died, so do excuse the sloppy bit. The headmistress is an evil so as soon as he starts going about going the kind so yeah you need to do exactly what he just says kill Gron the kind so you get this um quest saying um kill Gron the kind um and if you've killed her like me um before just click um, Girl of a Kind, it turns out that she's already killed. But if you haven't killed Girl of a Kind, um, just go to your map, go to maps, and then just click X if you want to avoid that little loading screen there. Um, go to Rifton, which is in like the, um, I don't know what you call it, um, kind of like the far east of the map. Um, so yeah, go to um, Rifton. I can't tell teleport from this location, but as soon as I'm in um, Riften, I'm gonna record the bit where you need to kill a girl of kind. Well, mainly where she's located. Okay, as soon as you're in Riften, all you need to do is um, where the entrance is. You just need to go across this bridge. Hello. Um, you need to go across this bridge. Um, go straight forward. Take a right. Go around here. Just keep on going. Go past this forge area. And then just go across this bridge where this funny looking lady with a funny looking hat is crossing. And then just turn right and then there you are. You're at this children's orphanage. So go in there. I've already killed Grandma the Kind. But there's like this old woman who's turned off all the children. And as soon as she's finished turning off the children, you just need to wipe her out. just need to abduct her. Like, okay. So, um, yeah, she's in here somewhere turning off all the kids. Um, so you need to kill her. It's like an old woman. So, um, yeah, well, once you've done that, what you need to do, you want to go back to that kid in Windhelm. So, yeah, let's get back to Windhelm and see how that kid accepts our killing, if you want to say. Okay, so as soon as you're back in Windhelm in the kid's little um, place, you find him on his bench. Please don't feel conscience, Michelle. He really is kind. 
So you want to click on um, Gorilla, it turns out that she's already killed. You did? Really? This is the best news I've ever gotten. And then he I starts mean, getting all party rocking. Good. Just not that good. You killed the old hag before I even asked. Oh, and please, take this as payment. It's an old family heirloom. It's supposed to be pretty valuable. It should fetch you a nice price. Thank you again. So yeah, once you've done that, um, you kind of, um, kind of like not in the Dark Brotherhood, if you know what I'm saying. So what you want to do, um, when you've done that, when you've killed Grand of a Kind, um, this is where it gets a bit confusing. You need to go out of Windhelm, and then you need to sleep in any inn. And when I say inn, I mean like, um, for example, Falkreef, which is kind of like, um, the, the far south of the map. Um, so did I say west before for Rift now? I meant east. But yeah, far south of the map, down here. Um, go to there or either any place. Just go to Falkreef, follow my advice. Go to Falkreef because, I don't know, I like this place. And uh, go to the Dead Man's Drink, which is one of the um, fancy little like pub parties in Falkreef. So yeah, it's right opposite the um, Penny Goods store and the Blacksmith. So you'll have no trouble finding it. Um, so yeah, just go in there, Dead Man's Drink, and then um, just afford a bed, just afford a bed, which is about 10 gold, 10 gold, I think, yeah, 10 gold, and uh, yeah, so just go over to, oh, hello, pretty, uh, yeah, just go over to this lady here, and then say, I'd like to rent a room. Okay, so once you've done that, you just need to go in any um, bed, well, I, I go in this one, so yeah, go to any inn. Uh, go to Falkreath, go to the Dead Man's Drink, then pay for a room for 10 gold, and then sleep in the bed. Okay, so if you, once you've done that, you kind of wake up in this abandoned shack, and you see like this assassin hanging off kind of like um, a wardrobe. Um, so yeah, she says sleep well, and just say what, where am I? Does it matter? You're warm, dry, and still very much alive. That's more than can be said for old Grillard. Hmm? So this is where you kind of enter in the Dark Brotherhood. Half of Skyrim knows. Old hag gets butchered in her own orphanage. Things like that tend to get around. Oh, but don't misunderstand. I'm not criticizing. It was a good kill. Old Crow had it coming, and you saved a group of urchins to boot. But there is a slight mm, problem. Okay, click problem. A problem. You see, that little Aretino boy was looking for the Dark Brotherhood. You know the little boy in Windhelm. She, she's on about him. Grelod the Kind was, by all rights, a Dark Brotherhood contract. A kill that you stole. A kill you must repay. So go to um that one. We have no choice. Do you have to do that one? Well, now, funny you should ask. If you turn around, you'll notice my guests. I've collected them from. Well, that's not really important. The here and now. That's what matters. You see, there's a contract out on one of them, and that person can't leave this room alive. But. Which one? Go on. See if you can figure it out. Make your choice. Make your kill. I just want to observe and admire. Okay, so click I'll have no problem in this. Now that is a shame. But what you fail to realize is that you involved yourself in this insanity when you took Greylon's life. You made your choice. Now it's time to face the consequences of your actions. You don't leave this shack until someone dies. Okay, so you must kill someone, okay? So, yeah. Blood! Uh, but yeah, as you can see, behind you, behind the woman on the... What are you on? Anyway, yeah. Um, shut up! I'm trying to do a tutorial. Yes, I can. Because um, I've done this before. Shut up! But yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of crack on the floor. I'm joking. Um, you need to kill one of these and you've got to get it right. 
I went for this one because it was quite mouthy and talking. So yeah, go and kill this one, okay? Don't kill any of the others. Kill this one, okay? Because it's the most mouthiest one. So yeah, once you kill her, which I'm going to kill now. There we go. She, go over to her. Yeah. Quite a mouth on her. Yeah, quite a mouth on her. See, so I told you, she's quite mouthy. So go to, so who is... The high level. Oh, no, no, no. Don't you understand? Guilt, innocence, right, wrong, irrelevant. What matters is I ordered you to kill someone and you obeyed. Good. So I'm free to go. Of course. And you've repaid your debt in full. Here's the key to the shack. But why stop here? I say we take our relationship to the next level. I would like to officially extend to you an invitation to join my family, the Dark Brotherhood. In the southwest reaches of Skyrim. Here we go. This is when you start to join the Dark Brotherhood. And she mentions it. It's just beneath the road, hidden from view. When questioned by the Black Door, answer with the correct passphrase Silence, my brother. Then you're in, and your new life begins. I'll see you at home. Okay, so once you've done with that, I know it was kind of long, but um, you've got the key to get out of the shack. So um, just um, go out of the shack, just unlock it. And then as soon as you're, I, as soon as you're out, go back to Four Creeper Village where you slept in. And uh, yeah, I'll show you where to go from there. Okay, so once you're at Four Creeper, what you want to do? Oh, hello. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Sorry, I'm so popular on Skyrim, I get like posts every day, but anyway, moving on for my family um, lifetime in Skyrim, um, moving on back to the Dark Brotherhood um, um, tutorial. But yeah, um, what you want to do, um, once you're at Four Creef, uh, once you're back at Four Creef, what you want to do, I don't know I'm going up here, you want to go to this house over here, this kind of like old house that kind of reminds me of pine watch which is my old house in skyrim if you've been watching my um skyrim let's play uh, but yeah and also uh, what you want to do you want to go behind the house past these gravestones and then just go straight forward okay just put your mind on the straightforward bit okay and then you've got to make yourself through this dark dingy woods and then there's a drop okay and when you see this black water you know that you've nailed it so yeah and then you see this door you see the um the black water and then to your left you see the door so what you want to do when you get to this door I know it's quite mental with all the sounds um, but yeah once you have the door you want to activate it but yeah if you didn't get that what it said what is the music of life and you don't want to click any of these okay or you're screwed you just want to click silence my brother that's all you need to click silence my brother so what it says is welcome and then you're welcome to the Dark Brotherhood. So yeah, this is where your new life begins in the Dark Brotherhood. Just wait for the loading screen. And once you're in, all you want to do is go down. Basically just follow the quest marker. Well not the quest marker, but yeah. So yeah, once you're down there you can take pretty much anything you want. I would be careful because there may be some stuff that you may not allow to take. Uh, but yeah, once you're down here, um, there's the woman who's from like the hanging thing. Um, but yeah, and also around here there's a lot of clothes that you can wear, which I'm actually wearing at a moment for my scan. Let's play. Um, can you bugger off, please? Thank you very much. But yeah, once you, um, yeah, I would recommend uh, listening to her for a bit. Um, she, she blabs on, so I don't want to bore you with her um, nonsense. But yeah, um, once you're down there, past that woman who was at the shack thingy, you're here, you see that cool little stain thingy there, and then yeah. here you are, you just want to chat to these guys and make yourself comfortable in the Dark Brotherhood. But yeah, thanks for watching this video guys, hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, I actually joined the Dark Brotherhood not long ago, only a few days ago. This Saturday I um, did a Let's Play on Scam and joined the Dark Brotherhood. So yeah, only a few days ago I joined it, so I decided to um, put my effort and my work in to a video to make a tutorial for you guys to make a dark brotherhood um, 
tutorial. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Um, I'm not going to tell you to subscribe or any of that stuff because this is mainly for you if you want to join the Dark Brotherhood. And that's how you do it. No DLC packs involved with this. No level master. You've got to get to a certain level. All you need to do is follow what I did in this video. So yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video. And enjoy yourself in the Dark Brotherhood.